Hey guys, what's up? Cool stuff here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make this origami tank that looks like this. It's super cool, fun, easy, and you're going to love making this. And what you're going to need, you can need a sheet of paper and a sticky note. So, yeah. First off, what we're going to do with a sheet of paper, we're going to fold it in half. And we're going to crease. Nice crease. So now once you have this long rectangle sheet of paper, it's going to be at the end. And we're going to take this corner of the paper and fold it upward like this. Like that. And you're going to crease. And you're gonna unfold. And you can take this other sheet of paper, and you're gonna do well, this corner. Take this corner, and you're going to fold all the way to where. I don't know if you can see that, but um, um, hold on. To where the the, the thing is right here. I marked it to see that. And, and you're going to um, fold it to where this line ends here. Going to make a crease. Also, make nice creases so you can make the origami tank good. And then you unfold. And you can see this X. I don't know if you can see it too well. But um, I'm going to draw what I mean about this X. So so this is what I mean, the X, you know. So you can take these two, like right here. This probably might be the trickiest part of the origami tank, or like the most of all. You can take your two your pointy finger and your thumb and you're gonna take both of your hands and go like that to the uh triangles right here. And you're gonna Push them, push them. You can see that there's a triangle right here. I'm gonna push like this. Okay, so then you make this triangle shape and you're gonna squash it down. So, what we did again was we took the two pieces, of, um, took our both hands like this to the uh, triangle shape and we pushed like that down down go like that and we flipped it and there's gonna be an upside down triangle and we squashed it like that so you're gonna do that to the other side also so it's really cool you're gonna crease unfold do it again to where the line meets from the other one and crease Open up, and you're gonna tuck it in like that. So you're gonna have something that looks like this. Now, once you have this type of like football triangle thing, you, there's two flaps right here from the ones we made. Fold the upper flap from the triangle down. You can take this edge right here. I'm gonna fold it down to where the triangle, like to where this part of the triangle is. So you're gonna fold it down and you're gonna crease. Okay. Once you already have done that, you can take the bottom, bottom line right here, the two fingers, and you're going to fold it up again, all the way to where the edge right here on top meets. And you're going to do that for both sides. So you just have something that looks like this. Something that looks like that. So what we did was we fold the whole thing down. And we took the bottom, a piece of the bottom, like an inch. And we're going to actually fold it up. 
and you can take the flap and fold it back down. I'm gonna do that same to the other side. Take the flaps off, put this down here, fold it down, and crease. Okay, crease. And we fold it up. And then we take the flap here and we push it down. So now you should have something that looks like two arrows, like right now, and it's okay. So now you can take e like at either one from either one arrow. You can you're gonna take this part right here, right here, and we're going to like fold it up, but not all the way like this. You can fold it a little bit inch, so you will have time to do something else. So it's very important. So instead of folding it like that, let's go like that. And you can take the other one and you're gonna fold it down like that too. Just give out like a space like this. Like how I did it. Take a space right here because we need it. Then you're gonna flip it over. Okay. Take this part and you're gonna fold it up like this. You're gonna flip it over like this. Okay? And you're gonna take this part and you're gonna fold it down like this. So we're almost finished, folks. Almost finished. So now you have like the body part of the tank. But you can unfold and you see these two flaps. Like um fold them up from where you put them. Fold this one down. And in these two triangles, when you open the folds. You can see some space right here. You're gonna take these two flaps and you're gonna tuck them inside. And then you go like that. And that's how you make this part. So then you're gonna fold the triangle right here. So you see the tuck right here? You're gonna tuck this part right here under here, like right here. So you're gonna fold them and tuck them down. Like that, and you're gonna have this type of triangle fold. And you're gonna do that same thing to the other bot, to the other one. Fold this tip right here down under here, under here. So you're fold it down. So that's how you make that part. Don't worry if it's not like this is not perfect. Don't worry, it's not perfect, you know, it's okay, I guess, so I'm just gonna put this right here, so don't, don't worry, it's not perfect, I guess, I don't know, so then to make the wheels, you're gonna take right here, you're gonna see right here, these are like the wheels, you're gonna open, and you're gonna like, open kind of like this yeah. and then you do that to the other side so you're going to open this part this space and like bend it with your fingers a little bit like that so you can have this type of thing so now to make this ammo you can take this sticky note take like one and you know how this part of the stick right here you're going to roll it from the bottom to the top like this and roll it, roll it a lot. It's good to roll it. You can roll it all the way so that at the end the sticky part sticks so it doesn't unfold. So you can have something that looks like this. So now, after you have this, you can get your t um, tank and you see this part right here? There's like small hole here. You're gonna put the thing inside, so it kind of looks like the tank. So this is how to make your tank. So thanks for watching, guys. For thanks for watching, guys, for how to make this origami tank. Thank you guys for watching so much. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't. It's cool stuff too. Happy Thanksgiving if if, if you haven't. And thank you guys so much for watching. Like this video if you haven't, or dislike it, I don't know, just like it, and make a comment down below, and I'll see you next time.